means you have to come back again. If you try to enjoy the senses, that is materialistic way of life. Materialistic way of life is that I have got nice senses, let me enjoy the senses to the fullest extent. That is materialistic way of life. Just like cats, dogs and hogs. The hogs, whenever they are sexually inclined, they don't care for whether it is his mother or sister or this or that. That is stated in the Srimad Bhagavatam. Lote Kastana Kamana Arhati Bir Bhujan. Bir Bhujan. Bir Bhujan means true. And Bhujan means eater. So these two eaters, sense gratification, is not meant for this human form of life. Two eaters means this horse. The horse 
of sense gratification is not meant for this human form of life. Restriction. Therefore, in the human form of life, there is marriage system. Why? What is the marriage and prostitution? Marriage system means restricting sex life. Marriage system does not mean that you get a wife ah, without any payment to go on and restrict your sex life. No, that's not marriage. Marriage means to restrict your sex life. You will hunt for sex life here and there. No, you cannot do that. Here is your wife and that is only for child. It is a restriction. There are oh, four things. Yuki Bhagavami Samadha Siva Nityasya Jantu Nahi Tatra Shugana. Bhagavaya, sex life and meat eating. Amisha. Amisha means eating meat, fish, eggs. So, Bhagavaya means sex. Sex and meat eating, non vegetarian diet. Amisha. Madha Siva, intoxication. Nityasya-jantu. Every conditioned soul has natural inclination. Prabhiti. But one has to control that. That is human life. If you put yourself in the ways of natural inclination, that is not human life. You have to restrict. The whole human life is meant for learning restriction. That is human life. And that is perfect Vedic civilization. Tapo Dibbam Jena Suddheta Satya. One has to purify his existence. What is that existence? I am spirit, ever existing, eternal. Now I am contaminated this matter, therefore I am suffering. So I have to purify, just like you have to get free from the disease condition. Oh, when you get fever, you take treatment, not unrestricted enjoyment. The doctor says, don't do this, don't do this, don't do this. Similarly, this human form of life is to get out of this disease condition of life having a material body. See, if we don't rest it, then where is the treatment, where is the cure? The whole system is restriction. Tapa, the jump, just to concentrate one's activities, in austerities, penances, for transcendental realization. That is human form. But there are different orders of social society, brahmacari, priyastha, banaprastha, sanna. The whole process is to restrict. Ah, but priyastha householder means it giving a little license who cannot completely restrict sex life. That's all. Grihastha does not mean unrestricted sex life. If you are uh, known this married life like that, that's a wrong conception. You have to control. If you want to get out of this Disease condition of life. You cannot get out of disease than uh, unrestrictedly born enjoying your senses. No, that is not possible. Yadindriya prītaya āpṛṇoti nasādhu manne jato ātmanayam 
Asan Nafi asked the clay sadhi, how? Those who are indulging unrestrictedly in sense enjoyment civilization, uh, that is not good because that will lead him to accept next again this material body. Maybe human body or animal body or any body, but we has to accept this body. And as soon as you accept this body, then you have to undergo the threefold miseries of the body. Uh, but there's old age, diseases. These are the symptoms of threefold miseries. So people, one has to understand scientifically these things, but they are neglecting. Uh, so therefore, continuing suffering. They do not care for suffering also. Just as the animal, they are suffering, but they do not care for it. They forget. So practically, the sense gratification civilization means animal civilization. A little polish, that's all. 